So, Pat. 2 1 win in the week. Yeah. Against one cannon. Today, 0 0 away draw gets a decent odd downside. What do you make of the performance from half to half? Yeah, look, in the first half, I thought we probably had the better of the chances. Uh, clear cut that was. Um, and they gave themselves a platform to, to perform, basically, and that's all I ask. And that's sometimes we don't do the basics enough to then give us the chance to win the game of football. Um, and, you know, as a whole over the week, I think we've done that in performance levels. Um, I've kind of split the fixtures into blocks, really. This is kind of the end of our block. I think we've had a Saturday, Tuesday for the past um, maybe four weeks. So it'd be nice to have a week off where we can get on the training pitch, do a bit of recovery. Uh, a lot of them sort of running with knocks today. A lot of them really playing playing over the minutes they should be. Um, but that's just the nature of it. And the fact that they're digging in and we're getting results out of it, um, I couldn't be prouder, really. Um, so yeah, all in all, both, both halves performance-wise, I thought, I thought we dug deep um, and gave ourselves a platform to go and win it, basically. So from obviously the first half, it, we looked like we were properly you know, in the game, we had a decent chance, and then obviously the second half, we didn't fall off at all, we still kept the same energy levels, but Briz pushed a bit higher, and we, we, we coped and saw it out, and we could have snatched it at the end as well, there were chances either side could have snatched it. Yeah, both both sides had chances. I think I think I was forced into a substitution to bring um, Pocket on up front. I think that gives you a different dynamic, um, which maybe it is that we have to dig into a five. And, and you know, the one the one up front, he's not as mobile. I'm not sure you mind me saying that, um, but we know how dangerous he is. When he gets the ball to the feet, he can go and create something. Um, so it was just a little change of, change attack, of just to say, look, okay, let's dig in. Let's see where we can go. And like you say, we could have nicked it at the end. I think. You know, Odd Bank could have nicked it at the end of it as well. So, I think a draw probably was a fair result. Um, and look, we'll go in. We, we'll go in happy with a point. Uh, obviously, Briz coming up. Brislington. I'm hearing they're doing quite well today. Um, obviously, a week off has it's come at a good time for this fixture so to have this rest, recovery. Um, we just got to keep the same energy levels again and recovery and get our tactics across ready for this big game. Yeah, look, Briz are absolutely flying. They're, um, you know, I think they're unbeaten the past kind of twelve games. They got some quality players in there, um, people who can really cause you damage. Um, but yeah, like you say, we got enough time this week to kind of try and nullify it. Um, and you know, like I say, give ourselves a platform to win the game. It's as simple as that. Um, it's worth noting about the clean sheet today. I don't think we've had too many of those this year. So. Um, over in the moon and, and, and we know what Dane had one of the most potent strikers in the league in Luke, in Luke. so um, and, and we stopped him really creating anything so we're capable of doing it um, I think we're going to have to do it for five players as opposed to one um, but I don't think there's a better time to play him uh, you know the confidence will be high um, we'll look to go and press and we'll look to go and play high tempo um, and look whatever happens happens <laughs>